Today is lesson four on computer programming on Huda Math. Today we will be talking about variables. You may have heard the word variable before in math class. The, normally the first thing taught with variables is the letter X. And you're wondering what's the point of a variable and where am I going to use it? Well, you're going to use it today in computer programming. So open up your text editor. Type in our favorite line script type equals quote text forward slash JavaScript. Hopefully you're starting to memorize that. Then we will be talking about we're going to use the variable x. It could be y, it could be a, it could be someone's name. No matter what it is, it's a variable that we're going to fill with equals the number 2. From now on, since we're using more than line, one line of code to make sure JavaScript doesn't get confused, between the lines we add a semicolon. Our second line, as we've used before, is the document write function, document dot write, parentheses. We're going to do e uh, math expression here. It's actually going to be an algebraic expression. We're going to use our variable x plus, put in a space to make it more clear, plus the number 3. So you may know this right away. Um, if you put 2 in for x, what x plus 3 will be. But you can use a computer to solve math for you as you learn computer programming. So I'm not going to spoil the surprise. We'll close this script. We will save this document as variable.html on our desktop. Then we will close our text editor, open our web browser, open text called variable.html, and yes, you were correct, x plus 3, if x is 2, is 5. So 2 plus 3 is 5. So today, we've learned about variables. This was lesson 4, and hopefully you found it interesting.